welcome to my youtube channel and if you're a new subscriber you are most welcome to the family and if you're a returning subscriber i love you so much so today i'm doing the ccme challenge and i've been seeing a lot of videos and decided to just join the line <laughs> so um ccme is a lifestyle and a food vlogger so i decided to be part of this and this is my 1500 and my list is here for the market so your girl is going to the market to cook with 1500 see you at the market and you know i've been procrastinating this challenge like i've been like when will i do it when will i do it every day i'll do it tomorrow i'll do it tomorrow i'll do it tomorrow and today is the tomorrow so see you in the market Right now we are going to the market to get uh, stops for the World Five Challenge. So this is my list. I'll be leaving the list on the description box yeah. so you'll get to see what I'm doing. This cow. Buy three hundred. Yes, sir. Uh, now, YouTube. Uh, I they tell you, you want to do stash and what soup? Let's do She not show. Sorry, not this. I know. Are you know? This is what we are doing. She has everything you need on your list there, so just buy them here. Okay. Grinded pepper. That's not one general you should have, it's one thousand. You will cut all those on off. Um. Where is the palm oil? Can I see? Okay. What's remaining? This is going to buy river fish and some more. And that's all. Okay. And I have 700 now changed. So let's go. Me in front. Check them. Mm. 
I think we're gonna see what we want inside. Go. I'm not seeing the thing. Why are you bringing that to me? <laughs> because <laughs> you know that stuff. This small market, you are shy. What if we are in the Budu market? What will you do? <laughs> Trying to be composed. <laughs> Go inside. That's the back. Turn around. Uh -huh. <laughs> Tell her the fish. She wants mangala fish. You get them? Uh -huh. Bring them. <laughs> Uh -huh. Is that fish we want? How much? For one. Mm. <laughs> no, give us 300. Can you see? So, which other fish is? Okay, yeah. Ladies, how much? This one, I want No, want big fish. Want just. We do, we do on budget. We do it now something she did use on for for video. She did YouTube. It's one one piece that is one small. Mm -hmm. Why is she big? Okay, come now, my sister. Oh yeah, she just can buy fish. Put one of this one. You scatter it inside. How much is remaining? Say she can give you for 300, Abby. No, 350. 350, and collect one. Mm. Okay, she give one. It's mangala fish. It's very tasty. So, that's why we need it. You explain what a wo soup is. It's our delta soup that we used to eat starch. <laughs> I'm doing voiceover for you. <laughs> From the market and it was really, really hilarious. <laughs> because one five is really small. One five is a small money. So let's go home and prepare the food things. because Well it's gonna be tasty because yeah, it's food yeah for we two. got we got yeah it's food for two, you know. I'm I'm single. I am actually single, I'm not married, so it's for me and my sister alone. So, and I'm preparing a whole soup and stash actually. So, it's a delta soup. Uh, yeah, delta soup. So, I'm doing delta whole soup and stash. So, let's get home and prepare the food together. Thank you. See ya. Happy birthday to my little cousin, my cousin. She's not little, she's grown now. <laughs> happy birthday, Iro. We love you from okay, Delta happy birthday, State. Iro. We love you. <laughs> Since I got from the market, this crayfish, bomo, dry river fish, also known as mangala. This is stock fish. This is magi, grinded pepper, the starch, the um, urobo oil. This is urobo oil because it's the best oil for. Oh, what soup? Then this is the starch for my tikna and also my potash for the tikna. Because some people they usually use gari, but I will want to use starch because starch will make the soup smooth for consumption. So keep washing. Thank you. So I'm putting the water. The quantity of water determine if you want your soup to be thick or you want it to be watery. So I put a little water. Thereafter, I put my bomo, diced bomo, and and the next thing I placed, put on the fire was the mangala fish, and I just want I want the fish and the bomo to be soft inside. That's why I had to put it together, and then I put my grinded pepper, 
and my maggi i put two cube of maggi so that it would be tasty i want much taste on it then after i went ahead to put i'm still putting maggi <laughs> Then I put my Celtic it my silk salt, uh, silk salt, that's salt I use. I didn't buy salt because I have salt at home. <laughs> and then I stir together and I put my stockfish. So the, then I will allow it to, I'll stir it together again and then I will allow it to boil. So it's already boiling. It's boiling, yes. So the next thing I put was my palm oil. I really made a mistake here because I thought the oil was not enough. So I, I added extra oil and that thing made my soup to be red. But it was it came out great. It came out great. It came out really great. So after that I stir to get there, of course, definitely, and I put my account that's potash. I put my potash, stir together, and I started getting my oh, well, so <laughs> can you see how it's boiling? And the, the soup was even boiling up because of the account, so I had to remove potash, sorry, because of the account. A cow is what we call it. So, and then I'm putting my crayfish. <laughs> I talk too much. My crayfish. I picked crayfish. I put inside. Stirring, stir. <laughs> and thereafter, uh, I allow it to stir, 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 and allow it to boil. And then I'm putting in my stash water for it to be thick. You know, some people they use curry, but me, I said to use starch because to make the food to be smooth in your mouth, and you don't want to eat something that will be rough. You get me? <laughs> so it's staring, and the food is ready, like it's ready. This food is ready. I don't know what to want to get. Huh? Your baby girl has cooked a whole soup, a whole soup. <laughs> so a whole soup is ready. A whole soup is ready. A whole soup is ready. You can see how it's looking so sumptuous. The way it's looking sumptuous, that was how it was looking delicious. You get as in it, was, it tasted delicious the way it's looking. The way it looks, it tastes the way it looks. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying. By now I'm saying something to you all. You all you understand me, right? <laughs> Man, the market as in I was so shy in that market. I don't know my problem. <laughs> so I had I had to add Maggi because it wasn't having taste. The taste was not enough. Stir together again and allow to boil a little. And my food is ready. <laughs> yep. That's the Owo soup with 1,500. See what came out. <laughs> if I if I had added water to it, I'd be more. So it's time to make stash. So I'm actually mixing the stash together so it doesn't bring seed no definitely i have to mix stash together and i'm putting my oil a little oil on the pot then i place it on the pot on the fire put my stash mix stash stash rather and i was staring while i was putting it so i'll keep stirring until it forms something solid so this is the stirring process. Man, I was stirring and stirring and stirring to make stash is now I use it. This kind of stash, if you go to some shop, it's very expensive. Like maybe from this stash, I think they'll make they cut it 100, 100, 100. Let me say 500 and I will come out of this stash because this stash is really much. And the work to make this stash is now easy. As I was making this stash, I was sweating. Like I was so <sighs> Your babe was tired, but then she has to. But because such is my favorite food, I I always find, as in I'm always happy whenever I'm making stash to eat. <laughs> so your girl is making the stash. <laughs> so 
this soup is a delta soup um delta tribe really eat this soup the shakiri the isoko the urobo we eat starch and either uwo or banga so we can eat uwo soup with either yam or plantain i don't guess so so that's it we can even use rice yeah <laughs> some people do so me i prefer my starch starch or, or yam yeah so i had to bring it down to stay together so that it will be smooth yeah as in the work in the process you all can wash it the process is not easy it's not easy but a girl got to do what got what she got to do boom, boom, boom. so we are still on it it's forming it's coming out you cannot see my stash <laughs> Oh my god, what's my problem? Okay, so you it's coming out. Yeah, see my stash. I my sister were crawling this part for filming this video. It was so funny. Your girl was tired, I bet she was frustrated, but thank god I made it. At least I've done my one five challenge. Yeah. So this is how the stash looks when it's well cooked, when it's well baked, when it's well packaged. So this is the finished look. Of my stash. <laughs> so tell me how the food tastes. Mmm, yummy. Mmm, like how many percent? Seventy-five. Hey, whoa! Mm, it's a pass mark, sure. Thank you. So I hope you guys enjoyed this my cooking video. This is my first cooking video. Hope you all enjoyed it. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, and leave a comment and tell me what you think about my 1-5 challenge. <laughs> Thank you and see you. God bless you. So this is the plate. The account is over there. We brought it out and that's it. The food is so delicious.